Hi everybody, today I'm going to show you how I refill my client's lashes. Well, basically just showing the cleansing process of the lashes, applying the eye pads and also removing the volume fans. The first step is to cleanse the lashes. I am using a brush. Um, I will post a link below where I find this brush and I'm just using uh, a foam cleanser that I've mixed together myself as one part baby shampoo, two parts um, distilled water or demineralized water and a quarter teaspoon of bicarb. I then move on to rinsing everything with saline solution, catching it in a tissue that I hold slightly on an angle. The client um, is slightly on an angle so the water doesn't pile up in the eyeball. until I don't see any more residue from the shampoo and I don't prime I only use saline solution because that really raises the cuticle and makes it really good to grab the glue later on now I give the lashes a really good brush and while I'm doing that I'm drying them off with a little handheld fan upper lids gently and I put them back down and then I wriggle the eye pad into place and then because this client has extremely long lashes that are kind of stuck a little bit on the bottom I just kind of use my fingers move them up and out of the way and then I place some micropore tape onto the bottom lashes to make sure none of the top lashes will stick to it and I repeat the same on the other side Not every single volume fan is perfect to remove and some are so what you're looking for is a little bit of natural hair which I'm grabbing now at the back and then you pull the rest of the fan towards you and it just should remove it really really nicely this only works if you use a tiny bit of glue on the, on the bottom again here I'm grabbing the bottom lash the natural lash on the bottom and then I'm going to pull the rest of the fan towards me. If you use too much glue, that doesn't work. because sometimes on the client doesn't clean the lashes particularly well you find that things clump together even though they were separated when you started it just happens my client here is extremely good with her lashes so I didn't really have to unstick anything at all I just remove the fans that have grown out more than like a mil and a half like this one has grown out quite a bit and as you can see I don't just have 3 or 40 volume on this um, client and I also have like 2 and 3D on the Tarnia lashes and they have grown out as well and they need to be removed as well. Now if you get kind of stuck in a situation where you can't remove the volume fan straight away because it's giving you some issues, don't get frustrated, just go back with the brush, brush through it, find the lash again 
or the volume fan and then we repeat it. That's what I've done here. Sometimes you don't get off straight away and then kind of the other lashes tangle around it and you don't know where you were. So just leave it, give it a good brush and try again. And this time it worked. to clean until it was ready for um, lashing again. So thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel to see more awesome videos and give me a thumbs up and have a read in the description to join my lash tribe.